So this is uh, not happy with the oil cooling of the nose oil cooler on November 735 Delta. This experiment is to identify increasing the size of the outlet ramp on the cooling line. And what I have here is a couple of pieces of paper. The popsicle stick is to give us a reference point when the airflow starts. I have a fan with an inclinometer so that we can change the angle of attack. And I've increased the ramp, put some tape on it so we can show airflow, and here's the opening. By the factory build, the opening has actually a seven degree nose up pitch. This ramp now has a five degree down pitch with relationship to the outlet edge of the opening. We'll turn the fan on, keep it at zero pitch, and the first thing, first we'll see what it does. All right, fan on. We can see airflow going past the ramp, and we can see that the two pieces of paper are now moving in. As an example of how, of how well this is doing, I'll cover the opening with a piece of paper and turn the fan off. All right, so we know we have a good vacuum being drawn just from the fan alone. Now we'll turn the fan back on. Air flows again. Now we're going to simulate pitching up. So we're going to change the inclinometer in the fan to 10 degrees nose up. We have 10 degrees nose up. We still have good airflow. And the tape we're showing past. Now we're going to increase this to 20 degrees nose up. And you can see inside we have turbulence. Effectively, we have no airflow through the MACTA. Still have airflow past here, but I would say at a 20 degrees nose up, we have no airflow through here. We have turbulence. Now let's, we're going to bring the airflow back down to 10 degrees. And now to zero. This is what the wind we would see in level flight. And now we're going to pitch down in a descent, 10 degrees. We still have airflow, but we have no airflow at the opening. Go to level flight. We're doing a ground test of the 
performance of the NACA on the oil cooler. Have our reference stick in place, two pieces of paper, no airflow. There's a fan with an inclinometer set at zero. Same position as before with the extension on the scoot on the outlet. Here's the factory uh, recommended build of the outlet of the oil cooler. Have some tape in place to show airflow. Inclinometer is set for zero. Turn the fan on. Airflow. Doesn't look like much is happening inside the scoop. As we did before, place a piece of paper in front to see if it holds. This time, it's not holding. Increase the angle of attack to five degrees. And now, <clears throat> we have the angle of attack set at 10 degrees, and it's holding the paper. We shift to 5 degrees, the paper is still in place. Go to zero pitch, and the paper falls. See what the paper, the airflow looks like when we shift to five degrees, and you can see that it starts to move. Five degrees and movement. Ten degrees, more flow. Ten degrees. Now we go for a down angle, five degrees, no movement. Still have airflow, but very little airflow across the opening. This graph shows that the extension provides more effective cooling in level flight.